We're on Funko Pop missions, and we were looking them up online last night. Thanks, internet. <laughs> You know what you just caused us to do, Internet? Oh my gosh. Now we are like on this mission for these. We're going right now to the mall, but there are a lot of different places in our area apparently that carry them. And if, if we, we can't can find them. If we can make it, we're going to check EB Games, Hot Topic, Toys R Us. Um, Possibly Winners Walmart, might have a toy section, Walmart. Jeez. Uh, we'll we'll see. let you know we'll where, where else we go. We go. Um, but we're looking for specific ones, like um, Harry Potter. The Harry see. Potter ones. I love Harry Potter. I'm not like obsessed, but I love Dobby. Um, I call him Dobby. I don't know if his name is Dobby or whatever it is. I call him Dobby. He's the cute little house elf, and he, his is super cute. So I'm also looking for the Dementor. Um, now, we are in Canada, and apparently, from the research I've been doing, it's a little harder to find in store. Yeah. Um, Funko Pops in Canada, but online we can get them. We just wanted to check out, first of all, the physical retail stores before we go on an online hunting mission. Yeah, because we will get them, like we've seen some online. I love Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice is like my most favorite movie in the entire world. We're at the mall, man. Oh, Move. come on, bud. We're on a mission. Move your butt. <laughs> um, so, Beetlejuice is my most favorite. Now, his is not super, super cool, but it is cool, so if I see the Beetlejuice one, I'm definitely going to get it. Um, and... I like Ninja Turtles. The Ninja like Turtles are movies. cool. There's, um, Hordak from, like, the, you know, the He-Man and She-Ra series? Like, we're from the 80s, so we're that's old, what we... Man. That's what we grew up watching, and there's some really cool ones of those. Most of them are rare, but... Wish us luck. We're yeah. heading into the mall. Okay, so we were... You don't stop Kyle on a mission. We'll show you what we, stop what we it. get. <laughs> Come on! You'll never know! You'll oh, yeah. never guess! <laughs> we went, we were surprised at what we found. We didn't really think we were going to find anything. We found, um, okay, where did we go first? EB Games. And we found Voldemort, actually. And I found Spike from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Unfortunately, you have to get Angel and Buffy with him as a three-pack. But they're kind of boring looking. I just wanted the Spike. So I passed on that. Voldemort is really, really cool. And I, I might be saying his name wrong, but that's how I say Voldemort. And I was going to get him, but then I wasn't. And I wanted to see what else was out there. We're going to another EB game, so, so maybe. Maybe. If he's there, then I'll get him. But anyway, then we went to HMV and I found Dobby. <laughs> I was so excited. <laughs> And it's a butt you can't see him right now. We we'll will, save that till the end. We'll reveal him at home. I'm so happy And you happy will see that. him in his pride and glory. Um, Dobby or Dobby and um, what's the, uh, Dementor were the two that you were like, oh, they're really special looking online yeah. that you wanted. So we actually found him. I can't believe we found him because like we thought he was pretty hard to find. Oh yeah, didn't we want to go to Toys R Us? On the way back. On the way because back. Because we're okay. gonna hit best we're gonna go back that way oh, and hit yeah, Best yeah, Buy yeah. and we okay. still got time. So I um we're going now to oh and we also went to Hot Topic. They had some cool ones actually. They had like Stewie and Peter from Family Guy and they were kinda cool but And HMV um, too we went to. Yeah, I just said oh, that's sorry. where we found Dobie, and um, they get. But you can't see him yet. He's a secret. What he looks like, you see. He's so you'll cute. Ha you'll have to wait. He's really cute. You're gonna love him. His, his ears are almost as big as mine. <laughs> um, okay, so right now we're going to EB Games, uh, the another one around here, and we'll see you later, Alla Gators. Yeah. Okay, we're out of EB Games, and we also checked winners. But our Winners is currently moving. moving to a different store, so they didn't have a lot. They only had a few, and we didn't need them. But we found one we were looking for in EB Games, and we'll just not tell you. Oh, it's, it's a, a surprise. Spot. It's one of our, our favorite uh, horror movie characters, too. Yes, and it's one that we really wanted. I'm sorry, it's a little bumpity. Um, so my arm's a little funny holding the camera. Sorry. Um, 
and we were out of our sugar-free syrups. I believe we showed them in a couple of videos. We like flavoring everything with them, like protein pancakes, oatmeal, yogurt. They're amazing because they come in big bottles, and we were out, and when we checked winners last time, they were completely out. They only had almonds, and we already have some almonds, so we didn't need it. So, Toys R Us time. It's Toys R Us time, but Woo! we'll show you all of our syrups when we get when we get home and don't don't make Kyle wait because she's she needs <laughs> to go on a mission <laughs> oh God. see you soon okay so we just came out of Toys R Us which is a toy store people and first of all we went we searched the entire store on our own and we couldn't find one single Funko Pop then we had to ask an employee and when we asked her where they were or if they carried them, she stared at us like we had six for, heads. For two minutes, she stared at us <laughs> and didn't say anything. Now, I know we're weird, but you, you should know what those are. They're incredibly popular. And we're late coming to the game of collecting these. And you and it's, she had no idea what we were talking about. Put it about. this way, it's not a rare thing in toy yeah. stores. Not uh, not anywhere else. Everyone carries them, and but Toys R Us doesn't carry them. They we, had like two Walking Dead ones. We That's just it. came out of Winners that had triple the amount Winners that Toys R Us Funko Pops. Had. Winners and Toys R Us doesn't. Toys R Us, you're a toy store. Hello. Hi. The mission continues. Yeah. Uh, we did not find anything in Best Buy. However, we have another EB Games to go to and Staples and there is a Walmart out in that area so even though we didn't have any luck at the Walmart we went to already, we may go to this Walmart. We will see how we feel. Yeah, we'll check our third EB Games out for the night. Yeah, okay. but I mean, even if we don't find anything else, I'm pretty excited about the two that we did find and the sugar-free syrups is another find because those are amazing. And um, the, they flavor everything and there's no calories or anything in them. So yeah, yeah, pretty excited about that. So we will check back in with you after our next few stores. Yep. You like those syrups? We're back. Oh, we're back. Look at these. So we had the caramel before and that was really good. And I wanted to try the salted caramel. So these are $5.99 at Walmart and you get... Winners. Sorry. I don't know why I said Walmart. At Winners. You get 750 milliliters. And they are called Jordan's Skinny Syrups. And they are zero calories and zero sugar. Um, and I, like I said, we use these for everything. We've had the red velvet and the coconut before and they're amazing. Mmm, caramel pecan. Um, yeah, this is cool. I've not seen this one before. I'm really excited for the caramel pecan. I think that's going to taste amazing in oatmeal and in a protein pancake. Look at that. Too. We even got a signature series. And look at this one. This is tiramisu flavor. So that's really cool. I'm excited. Oh, yeah. Um, that'll be really good in oatmeal too, actually. All and this these... mocha one is going to be really neat yeah. to try. I'm excited to try them all, actually. They're great in oatmeal. Oh, you know what this one would be good in? Um, making a frozen coffee. Hmm. Yeah, it would actually. Mm -hmm. we'll that would be really good flavor, actually. I like a see. like a coffee drink. So, um, yes, this is our syrup collection. Excited about that. And look at my friend. Isn't he so cute? This is Dobby or Dobby, however you say it. We'll take him out of the box and give you a, a better view in a second. We'll just show you the box. First. Yeah, so this is what the box looks like. Um, and on the side, they all have a number. So this is number 17. And then this is the back and it shows you all of the different want characters in, in this series. Um, there was the girls at the store were telling us that there are two different Harry Potter series. So this is one of the series. Um, yeah, and then this side just, again, shows number 17. But he's so cute. He's really cute. And then, so this is the one that um, we had said we really, really, really wanted um, together, both of us. And I really wanted Dobie because I love 
um, I love him. He's my favorite character from Harry Potter. Um, but we wanted Jack Skellington. Oh, yeah. And we found him, and he was the only one. And the girls at EB Games said he was the only one left, and he had been around for a while. And if we didn't get him, there probably wasn't going to be another shipment. Because he's an older one, I think. Yeah. yeah. So he was um, $11.99. And Dobie was $14.99. So this is what the Jack Skellington one looks like. Um, this is what the side looks like. And then these are the characters in, in this series. And if you can see here, there's Boo from Monsters, Inc. I would love to mm -hmm. have her. She is so cute. She's my favorite character from Monsters, Inc. Um, yeah. So we'll take them out of the box and give you guys a better look. He is awesome. He is so cool. So that's what he looks like from the front. And then I'll, um, I'll turn him around for you. <laughs> he is so cool. I like his suit. Yeah. And his big head. He kind of has a Hank head, actually, like a gigantic head. Like he, yeah, he'd tip over if he like went the wrong way. Yeah, and Dobie has Hank's ears. So if you put them together, you have like a weird looking Hank. <laughs> and look at Toby, he's so cute. You this have to love him. <laughs> Isn't he cute? And if you guys collect these, let us know if you collect them and let us know what your favorite one is or if there's one that you're looking for yeah. or whatever. Or if you guys like have an obsession with Dobie like me. And then that's what he looks like from the back. You know, he reminds me of Hank too with his ears. And yeah. he also reminds me of Gizmo from the Gremlins. I want, that's the other one that I want really, really bad is Gizmo. I don't know if they have one. I have to, I have to look it up. We have to do more research guys because we're like brand new we're to brand this new. Uh, we're like, Funko Pop game. We're like babies yeah. learning the game. <laughs> um, but doesn't he remind you of Hank? Yeah. Look at little, did you do this? Big head and then doby <laughs> ears and that's Hank. Yeah. <laughs> He's so cute. I love him. Hank's and our I, Boston Terrier if you guys don't know. Oh, everybody knows Hank. You gotta love him. Really cool. I like Doby's little feet too. And look, he has his sock. He has the sock in his hand. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you have to know Harry Potter for that. So, um, yeah. Look it. So we're pretty happy with Yeah, them. we're pretty happy with They'll those. They'll go cool on our movie shelf. Yep. And I'm going to do more research because I would really love to have Gizmo because he is super cute. And I'm still on the Dementor mission. I need to find that one. And um, I would like to have Spike from Buffy. Yeah, he's pretty cool. From Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Um, and Edward Scissorhands, we had seen that one. That one's pretty cool. Yeah. And Jason and Freddy, they're really cute. I know that they're horror and, figures, uh, but they're cute. Leatherface and oh yeah, Leatherface there's is a, cute too. There's an unmasked Jason that's really funny looking because yes. there's one uh, droopy oh. eye. And um, yeah, Leatherface. Is, is awesome. We've yeah. seen that one online today yeah. and that one's really, really cool. Um, what was, there was a couple other ones that we were looking at. Um, I don't know if you guys are Buffy the Vampire oh. Slayer series fans, but there was this episode, I think it was titled The Gentleman. Yeah, I think so. It's like these creepy guys that like, I think they take your voice, don't they? they? Yeah, they float yeah. around and they have silver teeth they and are, bald heads. And it's like, yeah. it's it's the creepiest episode of Buffy. Like, it's really creepy. <laughs> even and like, got, even people that don't think they might not like Buffy, if you're a... Uh, a scary like a movie fan or whatever, you'd probably like that episode. And the and the the Funko Pop of that one is really, really cool. Yeah. The gentleman, I would like to have that one too. Yeah, me too. Yeah, so these are our new friends. Welcome to our home, friends. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take good care of you and you're going right back in the box. You're going in the box for safekeeping. Tap them on the head, that's what you do to cute things. That's what I do to Hank. I tap him on the head. Thanks for coming along on our journey, guys. <laughs> yeah, don't forget to check us out on Instagram. Cause we post there in in the in-betweens. Yep. And um uh yeah. 
just be our friend. <laughs> um, <laughs> thank you guys for watching and for all your support. Don't forget to like and subscribe because you know what I do. You know what happened. If you don't, this time. Boom. Goodbye. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye, friends. Mm-hmm. <laughs>